All right, guys, we're back on this rear door. I ended up taking the this is the driver's rear door. I took the door off, and it just I wasn't feeling all that good, so I reblocked the whole door with some 36 grit, and I got it where I finally I just had some high spots and low spots, and it just didn't feel good. So I reblocked the whole door with 36, blocked it again with. 80, 120, 180, and then I did a thin skim coat to fill in all the little tiny pinholes you get in your filler, and then blocked that with 80 grit, 120, 180, and now it's ready for primer. So I'll stick you guys up in the stand and get ready for prime. One cone down, two to go. All right, here's the door primed. So you can see it's got some orange peel, but it's not bad. And it's primer, so it's all gonna get sanded. But kind of hard to tell with this lighting, but it looks pretty good, looks pretty straight. I'm happy with it. I have a little here. I'm not really too happy with I'll have to touch that up and then I'm not really happy with this body line down here we're gonna touch that up too but sometimes you just can't see it until it's in primer and then the rest of the door so now the car I have some guide coat on I don't really know why because I'm gonna pull I think I'm gonna pull all the doors off, sand the jams, and then flip the doors over on the stands. So like, I'll have this door flipped over, sand the jams, 
flip the door back like this, block it, and then the door will be ready for paint. And the idea is I'll do that to the four doors and the fenders. And then we'll do, yeah, I'll just come around the car here. I started sanding this side. So I got this jam pretty much sanded up to here. So it's sanded up here and then right up to about this point. And then I gotta sand that a little bit. And then this jam will be ready. So then I'll take these hinges off, sand the hinges, sand this, take the door off, sand, take the door and the hinges off, sand up and inside there. I'll have to take the fender off. And then I'll get the car down on the ground. I'm gonna do whatever I gotta do up top here and on the roof get the trunk lid fit and then I think I'm just gonna paint the shell or I'll paint the car jams zoom out here. then I'll paint the car jams I'll paint the quarters the roof and then this part of the car will be done and then I'll jam the doors the fenders the hood the trunk lid and then just paint them and hang them and be done so moving on little by little, one day at a time, guys. Until next time, take care.